Hello and welcome to another episode of the Tejano Traveler. Today's adventure continues Houston as we go to the Museum of Fine Arts, which is one of my favorite museums in Texas. We've got a great collection of antiques, current, impressionist, modern, they got it all especially art from different countries and different cultures. It's a pretty awesome place to go to. So if you ever get a chance to go to Houston and you only have time for one museum, make sure it is this one. As you can see, there's a lot of great artwork to look at. I've visited maybe 10, 11 times since 2000 and I always find something new and interesting. So they keep a good rotation of the art. If you like impressionistic art, this is a pretty cool place to go see it. I love seeing the vibrant colors of shapes and everything. And look at that, look at that yellow. Look at those reds and oranges and those nude ladies fighting bulls and everything you got realistic artwork portraits stuff from colonial times stuff from the renaissance from really every every historical artistic era you will find it here i like these little mannequins that they have here and of course there's always like virgin marys everywhere but i love seeing some of the old colonial works that's what's been my favorite art kick lately is old Spanish colonial artwork. Look at the light sources of those. That's Solomon. That's my favorite king with his wife and some dude behind them. This is a cool room they have, it just has paintings all around. I wish I could just sit in there, but there's no sitting room. Once you see one side of the museum, you cross through a tunnel underground with this cool little art installation. And that takes you to the newest section of the museum. It's an annex of sorts, but it's all pretty much modern art. You have to pass through this extra tunnel that shows you different light sources. It's an Instagram person's dream come true, apparently. Once you're there, they have different art installations that you can look through. They got modern art, technological art, mixed media are they pretty much have everything and it's a pretty cool addition to the museum I've never seen it before I like this one the closer you get the better it gets hey Bill awesome isn't it and there was looking for great artwork but all I could find was Mark Rothko <sighs> Mark Rothko. Mm, so boring. I'm just kidding. He's one of my favorite artists, but that one's for you, Hardy. I miss you, Hardy. Now, a lot of people say, oh, I can do that. But once they actually try, like, no, it doesn't look good. I like this one here. It's just floating papers. different art installations. I've been liking art installations more and more because of the multimedia that they use. And then just splashes of color. I love color. Look at that yellow. Look at that red. And then once you're done with the modern art museum, 
you head on over to the Antiquities Museum. This was gold, gold from Africa. Nothing but gold. Look at that crown. I want to wear it. If there's a heist, I want to be involved. It also has a Mesoamerican collection, which is the best I've seen in Texas. That's my favorite mask. So, of course, I had to pose with it and say hi. Hey, people, like, subscribe, please. But some other artwork. And then there's a Hindu collection that you can look through. And this weird thing that you can walk through, but I think I'm too fat for it. Anyways, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't forget to go visit your local art museums and support all the great art that is going on in the world. Thanks for watching.